Uh, Daryl, we haven't spoken to you in a little while, but since then you've got weeks of experience in your rookie season under your belt. You got your first career sack uh, last week. How do you feel now compared to when you did before the season began? Uh, I feel a lot better. You know, I'm, I'm getting used to kind of the speed of the game and, um, you know, the, the defensive system we have here. So, uh, you know, I, obviously I just want to keep improving as the, the weeks go on. And, uh, you know, I'm having a lot of fun. we got a great group here. So I'm just excited to keep, keep going and, and, you know, win this week. So. Now you finally got your first CFL sack in BC. How good did that feel? I uh, felt amazing. You know, it's always nice to get that first one kind of under the belt. And, um, yeah, it was, it was a big play. You know, uh, obviously I, I'm going to try and keep on getting those. So, um, but, you know, it was, it was a big play for me, big moment, and I'm just going to keep, keep improving on it. Now, it's only been about five weeks, but it's been a very educational five weeks. What would you yourself tell five weeks ago you if you had the opportunity? What lessons have you learned? Um... I guess just just uh, just keep going, you know. Just uh, you know, don't get down on yourself if you're not getting the technique. Uh, you know, immediately just just keep working, and you know that's kind of what I've done over these last five weeks, and that's gonna what I'm gonna continue to do. So, um, but yeah, you know what? Just just keep working, getting your playbook, and um, you know, it's all it's eventually you know it's starting to come together, and um, you know that's uh, <laughs> I mean it, it's it's good. I'm, I'm progressing, and, and that's important. So. You're heading into your hometown of Hamilton, Ontario this Monday. Does this one have a special feeling to it, you know, and you're going to have lots of friends and family there? Absolutely. You know, I'm not, uh, I'm not, you know, going to be surprised at what that environment's like. Uh, you know, I've been, I've sat in those stands before and, and know exactly what that, this rivalry is all about. Uh, it's going to be a big game. You know, I'm excited. They're a real good football team. And, um, you know, we, we've been preparing real hard for this one. So uh, it's been circled on my calendar. I can't wait to go out there and play. What do you know about the Argo Taika rivalry? You said you watched some of the games, but this will be your first taste, uh, not only as a participant, but also as an enemy, as an Argo. Right. What are you expecting, knowing that you will have friends and family, but at the same time, you're an Argo in Hamilton? Yeah, it's it's definitely going to be different. You know, uh, I feel like some of my friends, uh, you know, they say, hey, they'll, they'll root for me, but they'll still probably boo me as I'm running out onto that field, just just as habit. But uh, no, I mean, you know what, I'm, I'm excited for it. You know, I, again, I, I know what the rivalry is all about. And, um, you know, that's that's what that's what the CFL is. You know, it's a, it's a great game and, you know, there's great fans and, you know, it's, it's going to be a special day. Best of luck on Monday, Daryl. Thank you so much.